Hey, thanks for joining us today. We're going to do a short video on dosing your aquarium. So is that like having two aquariums or two shots? No, I think that means dose like uh, like a medical dose, like a dosage. Just say. Hey YouTube, this is Peck Tech and I'm here with Leah again deep inside the aquarium in their back room here with all their livestock and it's really, really amazing and Leah's going to talk to us a little bit today about uh, dosing systems for salt water? Yes. For salt water tanks. So we're going to take a look here at what they've got. Okay. So one of the coolest innovations of the saltwater hobby is the invention of the dosing pump. Um, saltwater tanks, especially reef tanks, need a constant dosing of chemicals to keep your levels stable as the corals use levels like calcium, alkalinity, and magnesium to grow. Um, many of the hobbyists don't have the time or patience to dose on a daily basis and therefore dosing pumps make a great addition to the aquarium hobby. This is the eShops dosing pump here. Uh, we carry several different ones. This is probably our favorite. The main unit, the master unit, which is shown here, has two pumps on it. Um, we personally have calcium and alkalinity in this system here with its fancy little dosing chamber, which I'm quite fond of. Um, on this one, we have alkalinity in this pump, or in this chamber, and calcium in this chamber here. The, they also have a second unit, which is called the slave unit, which has three dosing pumps on it, and it connects to the master unit in case you needed to dose more items than just calcium and alkalinity. So if you wanted to add in amino acids, magnesium, trace elements, those kinds of things into the unit, you could as well. The dosing pumps are really nice because you can program them to dose as little or as much as you want. Um, multiple times per day. They will dose it down, I believe, um, as little as a milliliter. Um, we'll have to check on how much. I don't know how much they go. Um, on that, and you can dose multiple times per day. Really easy to program, really easy to use. You just run the tubes gravity fed down into your sump, which we have down here. And you can see where they actually come in. We've just used a simple airline valve to make sure that the material goes into the sump, which successfully doses for us here. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Check your levels, make sure everything is running where it needs to be, and adjust accordingly, and it does all the work for you. All right, thank you very much. All right. 